Every president of Rotary International selects a personal theme to unite and align Rotary globally. Current president Jennifer Jones selected the theme of Imagine Rotary. And to tell us all about it, please welcome the district governor of District 9800, Amanda Wendt. Welcome to this special day where we all come together to reflect, respect and celebrate what is great about our country, its diverse people and our friends. Hello, I'm Amanda Wendt, Governor of Rotary District 9800. With our commitment to a system of governance and a long-held culture that strives for inclusion, values a fair go, honours mateship and seeks to bring everyone on the journey to prosperity, Australia is a nation that takes community service to heart. And the numbers prove it. An astonishing three in 10 Australian adults volunteer, that's over six million people, contributing their time and effort to make a difference for their community. So is it any wonder that Rotary found a responsive home on these shores 100 years ago, a mere 20 years after Australia was federated? And we've earned the opportunity to look back and celebrate our substantial achievements for our club's local communities, through the Rotary Foundation and Rotary Australia Health. Looking to the next 100 years of Rotary in Australia, I know our members are dedicated to continuing to improve the lives of Australians and people around the world. This year, Rotary International President Jennifer Jones has challenged us to imagine. She says in order to live in the kind of society we want, we, need, we have to help build it. And I'm very proud to say that's exactly what the Rotary Clubs of District 9800 have been doing this year. Rotary North Baldwin have been the biggest recipient of district support this year on its Afghan refugee support project. We've partnered to provide funding for meal ingredients as well as introducing new volunteers to help collect and assemble relief kits of food, clothing, furniture and home goods for recently arrived families. This is an amazing project that makes a tangible difference to people who are looking to call Australia home. Our official district governor cluster visits have dedicated time to assembling thousands of nourishing soup kits for those Rotary Clubs to contribute to their local communities according to need. Our monthly volunteer with the district governor events have focused on clubs hands-on, meaningful and convenient projects, such as tree planting for the environment, assembling care packs for families escaping an unsafe home life for impact for women, providing good quality second-hand furniture, electronics and white goods to people in need through Wern and Rymern, assisting refugee families for the Afghan project, assembling nourishing food packs for local families in need, as well as in Ukraine through For a Meal, and supplying food packs and goods requested by those affected by floods. Our Rotary Clubs, of course, know their communities best, and their members have been true people of action, especially when disaster strikes. The Rotary Clubs of Northern Victoria, our Goldfields North and South clusters, have been coordinating public donations of money and requested goods to communities affected by the flooding and its ongoing impacts. And this has been coordinated by district members. And it also includes a contingent of our clubs, again supported by district, who are rolling out an innovative insurance information facility for flood affected for the flood affected and this has been staffed by volunteer insurance professionals. Rotary Achukamoama also recently rolled its sleeves up and collected, assembled and distributed mosquito repelling candles to bolster public health in the floods aftermath. And of course there are countless other actions by our Rotary Clubs and their members working every day to make a difference for their community 
and I want to say a huge thank you to you all. Australia Day is of course the time to come together to reflect, respect and celebrate not only what we love about Australia, but also Rotary's continuing role as a critical thread in the diverse fabric of our communities. So let's continue to connect with more of Australia's six million volunteers with our hands-on, meaningful and convenient projects that make such a difference to people's lives. Let's continue to respond to disaster and adversity with empathy, innovation and action. And most of all, let's continue to imagine what Rotary's next 100 years in Australia looks like. Thank you for spending some of your Australia Day with me this year. I do really appreciate it. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day with your family, friends and communities. Thanks very much, District Governor Amanda.